Hello everybody, this is Yoko's Anime Reactions. <sighs> God, I'm tired. I'm always freaking tired, I hate it. I can never go one day without being tired. I don't know why. Anyway. Oh, shut up. I don't, I really want to do DoorDash, but I don't want to do it right now. I might do it after did after work tomorrow. Anyway, this is gonna be my review for Attack on Titan season three finale or season three part season three episode twelve, I should say, not part. We're not getting to that yet. But <sighs> sorry. I actually forgot to mention this, I think last episode, but uh, between when the whole rice thing happened and, uh, they went to go and talk to the guy, they developed some new weapons to go against the Titans. So, essentially, they had it all, uh, shoot, what am I saying? They had the, uh, Aaron uses hardening ability. And whenever a titan would come near, a person would stand in that little hole as bait to try and draw it. And once it got close enough, they'd drop a gigantic uh, looking log thingy. I don't know what you would call it, but essentially it gets them at the nape and kills them. So, yeah, that essentially is actually a, that's actually a good way of doing that without putting people in danger. Anyway, uh... Sorry, there was something on my desk. I was like, is that a piece of food? Because I usually eat my dinner, my food at my desk, to be completely honest. Because then I can still, you know, do my stuff on my computer. Anyway, uh, shoot. But yeah, that's a new weapon they've developed in a bit. They developed another one, but that won't be shown until part two. Anyway. Ugh. <sighs> God, I am so freaking tired. They try to find out what that stuff is that's in the vial that Levi got from Kenny. But they can't because every time it gets, it gets exposed to air, it, van it dissipates. So they can't even do anything with it. So from what information they get from uh, Aaron on in historia about what that stuff is they plan on if they have to they plan on using it to make somebody into a titan and then they would have to eat a intelligent titan aka one of the other human titans in order to be like Aaron essentially so they give all that to Levi so that way he can make the call if they ever need to if they ever need to because at this point, they don't know if that's going to happen. Anyway, uh, Levi ends up talking with Ervin, and they plan on go making the trek to Shiganshina again. This time... Hmm? Okay. Anyway, they plan on making the trip there again, but thankfully they don't have to worry about the female titan showing up and killing everybody like last time. And Levi tries to talk Aravin out of going because in his condition right now, they kind of can't really afford to lose him at this point. Since he's the commander and, well, they can't afford to lose him. But Aravin is stubborn and is hellbent on going and finding out what the heck they've been trying to find out this whole time. So sadly, Levi cannot convince him to stay. And at the end of the episode, they head out to go on that mission, and that's when part two will end up starting. Oh, God. Part two. Freaking made me cry. Anyway, uh, we'll get this uploaded, and I will see you all next time.